What's up everybody? Welcome back to the AGHB channel. Today I'm riding out at the farm once again, but this time I'm out here because I got new handlebars finally and a new throttle tube. So I'm trying to get used to it. They feel really different. I know it's probably only like a half inch longer, but a half inch is like completely different to me. The arm pump is real right now. Why did I try to climb the side of a mountain? Within the first five minutes of riding on brand new handlebars. You ever have one of those days where you just feel a little sketchy when you're riding? Like, it's just, just something just doesn't feel right and you feel like you're gonna die? Definitely one of those days for me today. Every, I just feel different on the bike. Everything feels slippery, I feel unstable, I don't feel planted. I have no confidence in my riding ability today. Usually when I say that, I end up eating some pretty bad shit, but uh, hopefully I don't today. What I've learned, Josh, is I usually need some sort of a warm-up time. And what I don't normally do is give myself that time. I usually just go straight to a destination. I'm like, oh, that looks hard. Let's do it. And it never, ever ends well for me. It's a, it's a virgin-y type of ride right now. And I don't know if I'm ready to go into such places. Where's my calculator? According to my calculations, the wind is traveling northeast at three miles per hour. If I weigh 100 pounds and I'm traveling approximately 27.6 miles per hour at a 47 degree angle going uphill with the wind traveling downhill based on gravity, I have about a 4.9% chance of making it up that first try. That is roughly pretty, pretty accurate. 4.9, I'd give you that. on the dirt. Oh wait, that's what I am. <laughs> oh stupid. Shit. All right, let's all take a moment in this video to relax for one second. One freaking second. Let's just take a moment to also look at my bike and how beautifully trashed it is. It's beautiful. It's trashed. It's beautifully trashed. Because in pictures, it looks perfect. But then you get up close to it and you're like, this thing looks like it rolled down a couple of rocky hills. Which, it did. I don't know what that is. But we should definitely try it. Does it even go anywhere? a dead end to me but is it You're gonna walk through there. fine Josh fine I will walk the trail and see if it goes anywhere my wrists are like black but my arms are not because my sleeve keeps rolling up 
I swear to God, if I see a rattlesnake in here, there's massive caterpillars everywhere. They're just hanging up on the... All right, see that? Right there, right there, over there, over there. They're just, they're just climbing the weeds. We gotta get out of here. This might have been a bad idea, Josh. Um, I don't know, I guess just turn around. <sighs> now this is the official top of the freaking world. So while we're up here, let's just talk really quick about the freaking helmet mounts. I'm super duper stoked that these helmet mounts are actually working out for you guys. And I'm getting like, pictures from those of you who are buying it and you guys are sending me pictures showing me how it looks on your helmet they look freaking legit if you guys need an in-depth review of the helmet mount on like what comes in the kit what what screws you can get if you don't want to use the thumb screws to make it look cleaner if you want a better explanation make sure you go look at this video because i saw it the other day and to be honest it's literally better than my video my original video because i went into some detail but he laid it out just like piece by piece so i'm gonna put the link in the description below but the channel name is sketchon2 make sure you guys go and take a look at that video if you want to know more about the helmet mount This rock trail, this is gnarly, okay? I, it's actually a lot harder than it looked down there because then it just gets so rocky that you have to have momentum or you're just not making it up. And I messed up like so many times, not choosing the right line, not looking ahead far enough. But damn, this view looks a freaking good, okay? This view looks amazing. It was so worth coming up this sucky ass hill to get this and man does it feel good sit down how could she do with standing up right in the red you good nope she's not good <laughs> oh, shit hey Hold on. I'm dead. Is your foot there? Fuck, I don't want this to... I'm gonna lift this up. Try to fix yourself. I thought you were dead for sure. You're just kind of like limp. I thought I was dead. My neck really hurts. I don't know if I want to do that again right now because my neck really hurts. Well, of course not. Oh, look, we almost killed a caterpillar. What? Right there, right by your left. Oh, almost killed you too. Dude, these guys keep dodging us. Yeah, how about you go down there first and then figure out if it dead ends or not, and then I'll follow you. Well, 
Worst case scenario is we can go down the middle of the mountain right there. Brian, remember the last time we decided to follow you down some sketchy trail you've never been down before? So? Oh my god, there's a snake! Oh my god! Oh my god! No! There's a snake! Oh my god! Oh my god! There's a fucking snake! Hold it! Hold it! Hold it! I'm gonna grab it! Hold it! <sighs> You know what's funny? Suburban delinquent is always like, you're gonna see a snake out there one day. And I'm like, no, I'm not. There's not gonna be any snakes. Lo and behold, there's a freaking snake right in the middle. I have a phobia of snakes. It's, a, it's real. Like I, you couldn't pay me a million dollars to hold a snake. There's something about bushes and me. <laughs> Alright, I found the water tower. I've always wanted to come over here, but I didn't know how to get here because it looked like you had to go through the neighborhood. Well, it looks like I found a way over here. Alright, well, I guess I'll just end today's video right here. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to leave a like. Uh, slow thumbs up there. And we have an issue. most retarded thing I've ever done in my entire life and if you're new here make sure to subscribe so you can see more stupid adventures until next time peace I'll be that young rapping dude might just trap with you coming with the thunder baby might just clap it through I roll out in the morning light with that Harley bike